despite those childhood lessons about clearing our plates, often there is food left over. But what if instead of going into the waste bin, it could be used to heat your home? Well, that's what will soon happen in New York. From next year, the city's restaurants won't be allowed to send their food waste to landfills. Instead, some of it will be diverted to composting, and some will be turned into natural gas. The BBC's Michelle Fleury explains. And over here, we got our grease trap. Chef Charles Bowman isn't just concerned with the food on your plate, he also has designs on the food you leave behind. And here's some of the veg vegetables and stuff like that that have been peeled and cleaned, and uh, we'll keep that separate. Between 30 to 70 percent of waste produced in restaurants is actually food scraps. So in this kitchen, they separate organic waste from the rest. And his efforts will soon get a boost. Starting next year, in New York City, restaurants will be required to stop sending food waste to landfills. We're all going to have to comply where, you know, the landfills are getting too much. And it, it's something we can actually use for our good. The scraps will be converted into compost or natural gas. The goal is to keep it out of landfills, which is important to reduce harmful emissions. In a landfill, um, organic wastes decompose under anaerobic conditions. This leads to the release of a lot of methane from landfills, which is a very potent greenhouse gas and an irritant. And this is where some of that wasted food could end up, in an industrial site in Brooklyn. Welcome to the Newtown Creek Wastewater Treatment Plant, where the food will go into those silver eggs and come out as energy. This is the nerve center where the process is monitored. These eggs provide an oxygen-free environment where bacteria breaks down the organic waste, or black gold as they refer to it here. Through a porthole, we saw the bubbles of methane gas rising from the sludge, biogas that can eventually be used to heat your home. The plan here is to take food waste and import it into our digesters along with our domestic sludge. Um, and that will produce uh, biogas, which is energy. Um, and that energy for this facility will be cleaned up to pipeline quality um, and injected into the natural gas distribution system. This type of food recycling is more common in Europe, but it's an important step forward in a country known for its waste as well as its abundance. Michelle Fleury, BBC News, New York.